Okay, hey, what's up guys? I just wanted to jump in with basically really quick video because that was a thing that I really needed to sort out lately and this is for Flutter desktop. So this is when you are developing for Windows. And what I needed was to basically check out the position of the window and I needed a safe zone for that window. So I needed to know how big in pixels is the screen. And it was really hard to find. In the end, I had to ask on the GitHub. So shout out to Halil Dermus or however is it pronounced. I will link his GitHub in, in the description. And he's the one who helped me to figure this out. And what we are going to need is uh, the Windows 32 package. So we are going to do Flutter pub add win32 package. And we can go for Flutter pump get. And we are going to save it just in a string value for now. Oh, oh wait, we actually don't really have to. We can use this thing right here and say the screen resolution is. Or maybe, yeah, it, it, might, it might be better to actually include it in the variables. So let's go with string. Rest is going to be nothing. And now we are going to go with init state. And we what we are going to need to do is we'll need to set process DPI awareness to DPI awareness aware 2. Basically, what we are doing with this is making sure that the dimensions are going to be right, are going to be, well, the value that we actually need for the case when uh, the resolution scaling is set up on the screen. So it's going to actually give us good value for this. And then what we want, and this is going to be for the virtual screen, what I'm going to do. Virtual screen means all of your monitors combined. This, this is the virtual space that your PC has to work with. And you can also do just the main main monitor. Basically going to go get system metrics. And if we want a monitor, it's going to be SMCX full screen. This would be if we wanted just the one screen, but we want CX virtual screen. This is what, what we want when you generally do the save zone, you want to know the virtual screen if the window isn't moved to another monitor or stuff like that. And height, and, and this is going to be CY. Good. So now we can set res to with no width x height okay so we now know the resolution of the screen and the screen resolution is fairly easily just put it in here nice and build the app now that it's built we can see the screen resolution is 3440 1440 which it's correct because I have just one monitor with this ultra weight resolution. So everything's working just fine. And now you can use this to get your actual resolution for save zones or whatever actually you need. So yeah, thank you for watching this quick video. I hope it might help somebody. If it does, please leave a like, consider subscribing and see you in the next one. By the way, we just hit actually over 100 subscribers, which is great. So I'm planning to do something different a bit, maybe like a more of an exercise video where we are going to create an app and we are going to split it into the points where it's like I'm going to give you more stuff and more stuff and more stuff and you can try when you will be actually able to push it to the finish without watching the rest of the video. That's kind of the idea what I want to try. Or I want to try just some bigger application to do as a series.
So yeah, that will be it. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you in the next one. Bye.